Hey guys, so today I want to do a browser speed test here between Google Chrome at the top here, which is Google's mobile web browser here on Android. I updated it to the latest version today. And then we do have the new Brave browser, which comes with a built-in ad block already and also is using the bat token so you can reward your favorite creators monthly based on how much you go to their websites, how much you consume their content. Okay? So you can see here Brave Browser and here you have the Chrome Browser, okay? So let's do this over here. So I am on the Verge website, okay? The first thing you can find to be super annoying here with the Google Chrome Browser is the first thing that happens when you go to a website on the Chrome Browser, for example, the Verge, the Verge is you have an annoying ad pop up instantly and obviously it's a graphical one, uh, which is just annoying, you know. Here you can see uh, it has blocked it uh, naturally because usually, you can see it takes up too much space. Can you see that on the phone, uh, a ad takes up too much space, so it just becomes very weird to browse the internet. So you can see this one has blocked 41 ads and trackers on this website. That is pretty, that's a lot. So let's try a speed comparison. So we are going to tap on an article here at the same time and see which one loads up first. Let's go. Okay, interesting. That one seemed to be, in, uh, I think it was really, really identical there in speed. But again, here, I almost, I go down a little bit and oops, there we go. We can see an ad that fills the whole page. Now, yes, in this video, I have half the screen. I'm using two apps at the same time, but it's still pretty absurd that it should take up the whole screen here. It's just too much. I go down on the Brave browser and here you can see it's used as an ad, but you don't see it. So it doesn't destroy your browsing experience. Also, usually what happens, sometimes you accidentally tap on an ad, which is also super annoying. And it can also slow down your, your device. But the, the page is kind of loaded up at the same time. As you can see, on this page alone, I think it was 27 ads and trackers that it kind of uh, removed that it didn't allow to load. Okay, let's just go down here again and and let's see, let's see if I can, let's go with the recommended one down here and launch it. Oh, it has, uh, it didn't have the same. So let's just go back to the home page and I'm gonna load it, or let's see, tap on science and space. Okay, let's try that one out. Let's go. Oh my God. Okay, science, uh, let's go. Oh my God. Okay, that didn't work out because it has so small text. Wow, look at this, how slow it is. Oh, okay, let's, let's try this again. Let's just go to the home page. And let's launch another article. Let's launch this one, Bitcoin Bubble. Let's go. I don't know what is wrong with this website. There is something seriously wrong. Let's, let's try the Intel version. Whoa. Okay, the, on the first one, it was the same. Uh, but on this one, it was a clear win for the uh, Brave browser. Let's just go back and let's try another one. So let's try Facebook wants a social media. Okay, let's try this one. Okay, let's go. Again, uh, I could see that the Brave browser was faster there. Let's go back and let's try another one. Let's go to Microsoft now offers AI courses as skills. Okay, Microsoft. Okay, 
let's go. Okay, that one was pretty identical. Let's see, does this one have an ad? No. Does this one have an ad that slows down the page? Yeah. So you can see here, very annoying, that uh, sometimes it doesn't preload the thing. So it just comes up uh, a few seconds thereafter. Wow, another one. <laughs> okay, so you can see here, an ad over here. And I just go down two paragraphs, another one. Let's see. And another one. Oh my, oh my god, look at how big this one is. Okay, so you can see this is the major issue here. This one takes up so much space. That is insane. And look at this. Even here, Outbrain, it's also even more sponsored content. So this is not even this is not even real content from the website, The Verge. This is just sponsored stuff. You can see that it is also removed here, so you just get an overall better experience. So you can see no annoying trackers or things that blocks your screen. You only see that it would be something weird there. Uh, so yeah, uh, if you want to download the Brave Browser, then I will have a link in the description to that. And it will also help my channel out. Uh, wow, look at this glitch over here. Huh, that's strange. Okay, so have a great day everyone.